Hi, I'm Jenny Miller of Let's Get Sewing. Are you ready to take the fear and frustration out of your sewing experience and finally get sewing? Then you're in the right place. Be sure to click subscribe so you don't miss any of my tips and tutorials. And check out the caption too. There's a link to my website where you can find out more about my course, Conquer Your Sewing Machine, and future courses that I have coming. And now, let's get sewing. Today I want to talk to you a little bit about a symbol that you'll find sometimes on the outside of a pattern envelope. And that is this gauge right here. This line is often seen on a pattern envelope when the pattern is designed to be used with knits. And it is a stretch gauge. This is how you determine if the fabric that you have chosen for your project has enough stretch to work effectively and fit effectively with the pattern. So you see on here two arrows. Those indicate the direction that you're going to stretch your fabric. It's not very complicated, but I want to show you how it's done. So let's take a look. This particular one says it is me measuring the crosswise stretch of the fabric, so how it's going to stretch around the body. So I have this knit fabric, and this is my selvage along the side here. That would be the lengthwise grain. So we want to measure this crosswise grain. This is how it's going to go around the body, and you need to know if you have enough stretch in your fabric for the pattern. Some patterns need a really stretchy fabric, some only need a little bit of stretch, and so they put this gauge in here. And it says here that that crosswise stretch should be four centimeters. What that is referring to is if you just take a section of your fabric on this crosswise grain, you're going to pinch it right here at this end of the, at this end of the guide, and right here at this first arrow. Then you're going to stretch it until you get to the second arrow. And that tells me that there is enough stretch in this fabric for this particular pattern. If it didn't stretch that far, if it only had about this much stretch, that wouldn't be enough for this pattern. But this actually stretches past that, so we know that we have plenty of stretch for the pattern. So sewing with knits is not necessarily difficult, but it is a little bit different than working with woven fabrics. And so now I hope you will be able to use this to your advantage when you're selecting a knit to make sure you have the proper knit for your pattern. And now let's get sewing. Thank you for joining me today. My goal is to take the frustration out of your sewing experience. And so I hope my tips are helpful. Feel free to comment with any questions or ideas you may have. I will try to get back to you as soon as I can. Now, let's get sewing.